Hey, welcome to another edition of Vinny's Beer Reviews. It's the first beer review in my new apartment. I just moved, so I'm really excited to uh, inaugurate the apartment with Other Half Citra Plus Strata Double IPA. It's canned on the 20th of May, and it's 8.5%. So, um, with, as I've mentioned in the past, Citra is going to have that classic mango-y, gummy fruit, orange quality to it, maybe a hint of grapefruit. And Strata is kind of a newer hop. Uh, you can get some pineapple, some pine, uh, occasionally mango, a little bit of cannabis. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Pulling up to the screen here, it's got kind of a mid orangish glow to it. It's not very bright yellow, but it's definitely more of a new school color. Uh, nice, but a fingertip uh, white head on that. And uh, let's get a smell. Really tropical aroma. Um, I'm noticing some mango, a little bit of pineapple, um, maybe passion fruit. Yeah, it just smells super tropical. So uh, let's, let's get a taste on it. Cheers. Mm. It's really good. It almost tastes like um, hop fruity pebbles. Um, I'm tasting a lot of different fruit flavors. There's pineapple, there's mango. Uh, there's a little bit of grapefruit, some orangey citrus, marmalade. Um, it's a little sweet, kind of the malt uh, presence is actually kind of a nice backbone to it, so it makes it not too juicy. Really smooth for 8.5%. I feel like it's at like its prime peak right now. It's not too bitter, uh, but it hasn't faded either. There's just tons of flavor. Um, with these uh, dual hop series that Other Half puts out, I feel like uh, they can be hit or miss. Um, this one is really good though, um, so I'm pleased with that. Very thick uh, mouthfeel as well. In the back of the palate, I'm getting a little bit more um, kind of that er earthy, piney kind of cannabis notes, but the prevalent intro flavors are really strong with that mango, um, the grapefruit, and the orange. Mm. Um, we have maybe a little bit of passion fruit or... Some other kind of, you know, um, star fruit or something, but it, it's it's uh, it's really good. Um, like I said, super smooth. I mean, there's not much to pick at for this one. I feel like they really nailed the combo. Um, funny enough, I did a review with Citra and Strata Hops already together, and it, I didn't love it as much. But this one on its own, maybe with their house yeast, uh, it's just awesome. So they did a fantastic job. And like I said, it's really dangerously smooth, which is nice for that 8.5%. You, you know, you want to feel like you're not struggling through the glass. As it warms, there's a little bit more malt sweetness to it, but it's not, you know, old school in any means. There, that juiciness really uh, you know, packs an intro punch. Very complex. Um, uh, this is kind of what I expected when I first tried, you know, the Strata hops. Um, is that kind of mix between juicy, fruity with that earthiness, and they do a great job balancing it. Uh, a lot of the times, when the beer is too earthy, it can be kind of overpowering. But this is uh, just perfect with that citra combo. As far as a grade, uh, I think I'm gonna go, let's go one more sip. I think I'm gonna give this a 4.3. Um, I love the juicy quality, it's exotic, it's unique, uh, kind of stands, you know, it's, it makes it, sets itself up out from the pack and uh, it, it's just really good, so. 4.3, that's our review, and if you like what I see, <laughs> if you like what you see, I'd really appreciate it if you'd hit subscribe, and thanks for watching. Cheers.